Hey guys, so I want to do a quick um, video before I make a final decision on my new cosmetic pouch. So I just bought this today and um, I'm not really 100% sure if I'm going to keep it. And I'm also not 100% sure when this video is going to go up. So it may not go up till after I make my final decision. It may also not go up for a while. So anyways, what I wanted to share, not knowing if I am going to keep it, um, my reason being is I'm not sure if it really fits everything that I want it to fit in it. So if I don't end up keeping it, it will be because I get the toiletry um, 19 instead. But what I wanted to do really quick is just compare it to the mini pochette. So the mini pochette is um, uh, definitely smaller and I definitely think um, for makeup I would go with the cosmetic pouch um, but what I want to show you really quick is what I have in here because I actually am impressed with what can fit in here but my reason being for the bigger size is everything I have in here is basically what I would want to carry um, but then I also would like to carry, um, what I have in the mini as well. And I think with the toiletry 19, I could carry both. So all, everything in both of these just in one pouch. So that's why I'm thinking about returning this one and getting the new one. But let me show you what I have in here so far. So in here, I have a bunch of lip products, which are always what I end up carrying in my um, purse. And the way I had it packed, um, this is the only way that I have found to be able to fit all these. So what I did is I have my compact here and then I had certain ones laying up, up and down and then I have other ones going sideways. So um, let me continue pulling out all of my lip stuff that, so it does actually fit. I do have a mascara. Um, it does actually fit quite a bit. Um, I have my Chanel, I have a pen and this guy just fell out, but, um, I'm also thinking if I do keep the cosmetic, I should probably get maybe a different brush. I like to have a a bigger fluffier brush for this guy. So I bought this one um, from Ulta and I liked it because it was compact and it's really, really soft, but it may be one of those things that maybe buying a travel kabuki or something in there would be better. Um, so here is everything that I could fit in the cosmetic pouch. And I don't really think I could fit anything more in there. Um, I definitely should fit less, but so all of that stuff is what I fit in there. And I do think that it's a good size. Um, it's an awful lot of lip products and it did all fit in here, but here's my only other thing. I would like to not carry this if I carry a cosmetic pouch. So I want to be able to carry all of this and what I have in here. Um, I actually just threw this in just cause I wanted to show you that how much fits in this one, but in this one, I have another lipstick and I have a mirror, which I don't necessarily need the mirror if I carry this, but this is a much better mirror than what's on here. So I like to, I would like to be able to carry that. Um, my hydrating sugar, this I'd like to carry as well if possible. But like I said, if I carried that, I wouldn't need to carry the balm. Um, I do, the problem is when I go out, you never know what kind of lip you're going to want if you, for me, I'm in the house and I want one thing, then I am out and I want to bump it up a little bit more. So I want to add something different or, you know, these are good for a day. Like these three are kind of good for a day, but at night I like to do these. So I feel like I just do actually want to carry all of that. And then I also, this is my biggest thing, Kleenex. I want to be able to, and then just in the bottom of bobby pins, but so all of, let me move my all of this fits in my um, mini pochette. All of this fits in my cosmetic pouch. So my hope is, or hope was, to be able to also fit in here a mirror, a 
another lip thing, which obviously I can get rid of one of the other ones, but, and the Kleenex. And this Kleenex is pretty full. I could take out probably half of what's in here, but my goal was to be able to not have to carry two more accessories, two more small leather goods in my bags. So I'm still debating. I'm going to go tomorrow and check out, see if my store has the 19. And if it does, check it out and see. I just love the shape of this. I love the, I just feel like it's much more feminine. It's much more of a cosmetic pouch than the toiletry. Um, but we'll see. So I'm going to just repack this just so you guys can see how I did it. And I always need a pen and I'm realizing now my pens, um, I just, I want a pouch that all fits in. And I think the pochette accessory is my favorite for all of this stuff. It's a perfect size, but I don't like that it doesn't have this kind of lining. So if my makeup does spill, that's an issue. So that's my biggest concern with that, with why I don't. Oh, you know what? I actually did put one of these in. So I guess I wouldn't need that one. And I wouldn't need this one. But here's the thing. If I fit all that in there, I, I mean, to put my Kleenex in there and my mirror, I really don't think I'd be able to fit as much. Um, so that's my biggest thing is I'm just trying to kind of figure it out. I guess I could fit. And these guys, all that doesn't take up room, so I could fit these, those in. So I guess I could really make it work. Um, I'm curious to see kind of what I end up doing because I'm not really sure. Um, I kind of wasn't even thinking about the toiletry. I actually was thinking about the toiletry 26 more than the 19 because I never really expected to um, think that I needed to carry so much because I don't wear a ton. Oh, I forgot this. I don't wear a ton of makeup. So that's why I didn't think I needed so much to take with me. But then I'm realizing I do really take a lot of lipsticks so <laughs> I guess you know and then those can obviously fit in but see it's just this is just really kind of tight this is just with the extra mirror so it's all about how you pack it I guess too but um I don't want that so who knows I'm not really sure but at least now I have option yeah if I take that mirror out it does if I just kind of adjust it a little bit more maybe yeah, it does fit better, but who knows? I'll see. I will keep you all posted as to what I decide. But, um, so that's packed for that. These all go in there and then I'll just show you. Usually I'll put a feminine product or two on the bottom of that. And then I always like to have a mirror and I always like to have tissue and I always like to have my sugar. So those kind of go in there. And then I've only ever been able to really fit that on the top. But I do think if I did get the um, toiletry 19. I also would be able to fit like my phone charger. So we'll see what I end up deciding, but as always, I'll keep you all posted and I may end up keeping it. Um, I may end up just, uh, I don't know, getting both. Who knows? It kind of depends on how it fits in my purses as well. So that's something I'm going to play with a little bit tomorrow and see, um, which one, see how much this fits in. Um, of my purses. I think it would fit in all mine because I have the totally MM is my big one, the Speedy 30, two Speedy 30s, and my Bloomy just went off to be repaired. I do feel like this wouldn't fit in my Bloomy very well, whereas I do think that the um, toiletry may. I'm not really sure. I'm gonna have to go in and play, but anyways, thanks for checking out my video. Hopefully this will help if anyone is debating between the cosmetic and the mini pochette. Um, the mini pochette definitely works as a little wristlet. My phone doesn't fit in it anymore, which is kind of sad, but I do still like it for other things, um, or a big wallet kind of thing. But anyways, hope y'all are having a good day and I look forward to chatting with you all soon. Thanks for checking out my video. Um, as always, give it a thumbs up or subscribe and or subscribe and check out my Instagram account. If you have any questions, um, definitely link them down in the comments. Thank you. Bye-bye.